everyone and welcome to a new country with me. Today I am here in Vietnam and in this beautiful city of Da Nang. I am just outside my hotel. I'll quickly give you a room tour for it but let me tell you it's just opposite to the beach and it's beautiful. Let me show you around. See, this see are all the restaurants and hotels around the beach. That's the hotel in which we are. It's called Minton Safi Ocean. I hope I've got it right. So yeah, today is day one for me here and I'm off to the Bana Hills for a beautiful day here. So let's go and find out more about this place and explore. Let's go. Well, before we start exploring this beautiful city, let me give you a quick tour of our hotel. The room that we selected was the Delight Ocean King with sea view. And my, this room was spacious and it offered an incredible view of the beach. The amenities are top-notch, which made us stay here extremely comfortable. Now that we're settled in, let's head out to our first adventure. Well, that was the ride that we had to Bana Hills and we've reached Bana Hills now. Uh, Bana Hills is actually in the west side of Da Nang, the city in which I am. And uh, it is basically a hill station and a theme park. Uh, back in the day, the French used to use it as a resort for themselves. And now it's actually a very popular tourist spot, which is liked by people when they come in with family. And in, in general, it's a very beautiful place. And we are all set to go and explore today. So let's go in. The tickets were taken on the way. Uh, there are tickets available on Kluke as well. But we went on to one of these stores that our taxi driver took us to. And they charged us 900,000 for each person, which includes everything. If you do want to take the lunch buffet as well, then it would be uh, 1,200. But we opted out of that because we thought we'd rather go and explore what all is available to eat there. So now we are all set uh, and we are ready to go in. Let's go and see the Bana Hills. And here you see us waiting in queue for our transit to the entrance of the Bana Hills. where you could see this majestic golden entrance. Everything here is so picture worthy. You can literally take pictures at every corner. Once you start entering, you will see signs which will guide you towards the cable cars. But while doing so, you will also come across a lot of food stalls and souvenir stores. Keep walking ahead, you will find a lot of escalators which you can use to reach to the top. That's where the cable cars are. And once you reach there, you need to queue up and then literally jump into one of the cable cars because the cable cars don't stop, they keep moving. You just need to jump into them and get in uh, each of the pods. The cable car ride to the top offers breathtaking views of the lush green mountains and the valleys below. arrived at Bana Hills. This place is like a fairy tale village with its French inspired architecture and a beautifully landscaped gardens. Let's explore what this place has to offer once it stops pouring. <music> The mist is clearing up and you can place, see the place clearly now. Let me show you the place around. Inside the bar 
Carter Hills since this is a resort and a theme park. There are different areas and there are different things that you can do. Currently we are in this area which is called the amusement park. So it's basically gaming area, there are lots of games. Uh, there are VR games, there are uh, rides here. Uh, there is also a roller coaster here. Uh, although that's not working today is what I was told. But uh, yeah, that's a single person roller coaster and it's really fun. You can check out photos and videos online for it. But here, yeah, this is the park. There are a lot of rides it's just opposite to me. I see there's one which is starting off. Uh, let me show that to you too. But yeah, overall, a lot of things to do here for the entire family. all-inclusive so all these rights for you apart from the games where you can win prizes for those you need to pay extra but everything else which is uh, all these fun rides inside the amusement park comes free with the all-inclusive ticket so I think it's a great deal because there is so much to do there are these cool rides there are there's, there's rock climbing there's a lot of fun stuff to explore there are 4D movies 5D movies happening and there's also a 360 movie that I see ahead happening so yeah I think all in all there's a lot of things you can explore here worth the deal for the amount that you pay Bana Hills has a lot of things to explore you simply need to take the cable cars from one stop to the other. second spot so basically when you enter Bana Hills there uh, we were guided towards the amusement park area which we also have the French village so after seeing all of that uh, obviously you went to the cable car up and now you take another cable car and you come towards the golden bridge so now we have reached the spot let me show you how the bridge looks it's super crowded today our next stop was a visit to the famous golden bridge held up by giant stone hands. I'm sure all of you must have seen that on Instagram. The view from here is absolutely spectacular. You can walk around freely here, but yes, it does tend to get very crowded in the afternoon. So after an incredible day exploring the Bana Hills, as the sun sets, we're making our way back to the cable car for the descent. The experience has been unforgettable with so many beautiful sights and fun activities. We're heading back to our hotel because we are just going to do a quick change and then we are off to our next adventure in Hoi An. Tonight, we are experiencing the magical lantern boat activity. Hoi An is known for its vibrant lanterns and tonight we are setting sail on a lantern boat. As we glide down the river, we were surrounded by the warm glow of colourful lanterns, creating a truly enchanting atmosphere. This experience is both peaceful and mesmerising, as we float along the water illuminated by hundreds of lanterns. So make sure you come and do this and make a wish for yourself too. It's a perfect way to end our day taking in the beauty and tranquility of Hoi An by night. 
Well, that's it for today's vlog. We've had an amazing time exploring the Nang's Bana Hills and experiencing the magical lantern boat ride in Hoi An. Thank you for joining me on this adventure. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe for more travel vlogs. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.